Hello, Galaxy. I'm Chris Perillo, and in the news, GPT 4.0 is right around the corner, and with it, apparently, is going to come the ability to work with video in some way. That's kind of exciting. I don't know what that means for ChatGPT, but if you have not yet started using ChatGPT, you got to try it. Seriously, it's it's it, it's a thing. It's, it's, it's absolutely a thing, and once you start using it, you'll realize, oh, I should have used this months ago because it's that easy to use. And I, I started to think of, of ways that I use it and ways you might want to use it and how to slipstream it into your regular workflow. One way is you could use it to refine emails. Instead of writing a wall of text or, let's say, you're chatting with someone and you've written a wall of text, you can have ChatGPT summarize it. In fact, some people, if they're doing video and they need to write a script and they don't know where to begin they send their idea to chat gpt and then chat gpt does it for them it saves them so much time it's an amazing editor especially if you feed it information and give it context in your prompting that's a thing uh so i would say if you do any amount of writing chat gpt is a boon a second way you can slipstream it into your regular workflow is you can gen use it to generate sorry i keep slapping the mic there you can use it to generate the idea this, this you can use it to gen generate i should i should use this to write a script shouldn't i and stick to it uh generate ideas to solve problems it, or you know if, if you normally go to a search engine and search for you know articles on how to solve problems you can ask ChatGPT and have a dialogue an ongoing dialogue around a particular topic to ideate and get closer to finding a solution and, and thinking through the problem in talking to this bot it's amazing for the ideation process if you've not yet used that and the third way that you can uh, get uh, ChatGPT integrated into your life is you can use it to l do quick searches uh, on uh, you know information that you know it would have like modern or like uh, modern information um, you know, information that is let's say been that's not a part of the model over the past few years not gonna be all that helpful but the other day we were at uh, the bus stop uh, Jedi and I we were waiting for, for her to get on the bus and uh, the neighbor dad and I were talking and he said hey who are the original Avengers in the comics I'm like I'm, I'm not exactly sure so he gets on Google he does his search and I'm on chat GPT and I asked the same question because I knew that information was already out there and moreover I wasn't going to get inundated with ads or go to a spammy website or just get slapped with something I didn't want to see See, ChatGPT was able to give me the right information cleanly, quickly, efficiently. It worked exceedingly well. No ads, no wait. It was there, right there. Now, maybe you have other ways to integrate ChatGPT. Feel free to share them. We were throwing a few about tonight on live.perillo.com.